If snowboarding wasn't here, I don't know what the hell I'd be doing, honestly. It's pretty crazy to think about that. I don't know, like, I don't know what it's like to not have snowboarding, because I started when I was three. I started doing it when I was two years old. 13. From nine to 10 years old, it was all about snowboarding. Since I started, I never stopped thinking about it, and I, and I will never stop thinking about it. My job is snowboarding, my passion is snowboarding. Pretty much almost everyone that I know or hang out with is probably a snowboarder. It definitely is your lifestyle and the people you surround yourself with. I honestly couldn't imagine a life without snowboarding anymore because... It's everything I know, everything I am. I'm so proud of myself to be a snowboarder. Jake had a legendary impact on snowboarding. And I think Pat Bridges said it best when he says that Jake is the most influential snowboarder of all time. Um, not only because he was a pioneer, but because of the dedication he stuck with. I have conversations with people that I've never met before, and they're telling me how important Jake was in their life. First time I met Jake, he was super nice and friendly, and like, didn't feel like that person who would own a big company. He's always so positive and just so happy and always teasing you. And His passion for like innovating and for, for seeing how things can work in a new light was something that, I, well, something that I was so inspired by when I first met him. Jake just poured his whole life into creating something that is going to last for forever. U.S. Open is special to like so many of us because we did get to share that with him. Jake's vibe at the Open every year is just super energetic. He had big energy, you know, he was hyped. He represented this contest in a good way of always having fun and putting snowboarding first. Jake loved the U.S. Open, but it was not just about the contest, it was about hanging out with everyone. We don't have his exact presence, but his presence is all over this place and I'm, I'm, uh, I think it's going to be a special one. Life is unfair. You should still be here snowboarding with us because that's what you deserved. Snowboarding is like a way of life, I guess, and it gives people so much. If I could send a message to Jake right now, I would just be insanely thankful. He's made my life and so many of my best friends' lives amazing. Thank you for making snowboarding what it is today. We're just living the dream out here, riding powder and parks and on this piece of plank, you know? His legacy will continue to live on through all the snowboarders. We're gonna be bored for life. Thanks, Jake. Thanks, Jake. See you, Jake. Thank you, Jake. Thanks, Jake. Thanks so much, Jake. Thank you, Jake. Thank you, Jake. Thanks, Jake. Thanks, Jake, and thanks, snowboarding. Thank you, Jake, for everything. Missed the shit out of you.